So I've had a lot of people reaching out to me, you know, what, what does this injection do? What do you feel? So this medication, Z-A-R-X-I-O, I'm not even sure how to say it. But what it does is it causes my bones to leak the, uh, the stem cells and leak the white blood cells out into my bloodstream. So on the extraction day, uh, transplant day, um, they're removing it from me tomorrow. Tomorrow's day five. And this allows the five days of injections allows uh, those cells to populate my bloodstream. So uh, when, they, when it comes time to take it out, it could take uh, four to six to eight hours. Uh, in rare occasions, it might take up to two days to filter enough blood through my body, through my system, so they can get enough of the stem cells and white blood cells uh, into that bag that's going to be uh, given to my brother. So I'm briefly going to talk about some of the side effects on this uh, each day. I broke it down. So here it goes. So there are a couple rare extreme cases of side effects uh, from this medication. Um, the three most extreme side effects uh, are heart attack, uh, spleen rupture, blood clotting. Hopefully none of those will happen. Hopefully we'll be all good. All right, I'm headed into day two. I'm about to give myself the second day's worth of injections. Uh, 24 hours in, and really all I notice is some hip and uh, upper leg pain, nothing, nothing too severe. So I'm at day three of the injection. So I'm about to shoot myself up again with three more. Um, I woke up this morning, just normal aches and pains. Uh, yesterday was actually a fairly hard day. The pain was a little more severe than uh, I think they were letting on that it would be. Um, but uh, I called the doctor, told him uh, the pain situation, and they prescribed me something called Norco. So the pharmacist handed this to me, and uh, oh, by the way, this causes uh, extreme constipation. You, you wear that, I'm like, what? I am not in the mood for something else. So then he handed me this, stool softener. I'm like, you know what? I don't need the stool softener. I don't need the Norco. I'm gonna just deal with the pain. One thing is enough for me right now. So uh, we'll see how that goes. That might be a totally different story. Tomorrow I might be saying, you know, give me that stool softener and Norco back. Um, but um, yeah, the pain, was, the pain was fairly severe, but uh, we'll get through it. Short-term pain, long-term gain. So right now, this is day four of injections for me. And last night was, uh, was probably the roughest night I've had uh, due to a constant headache. Uh, just couldn't shake it. Um, took a two-hour shower. I'm sorry, California Water Authority, for that uh, between 1 a.m. and 3 a.m. That's the only thing that kind of made me feel better. Then I got up and I took another hot shower, uh, kind of put me at ease. Uh, currently, my, my legs and hips are quite sore. Uh, my legs feel a little bit wobbly. Um, I've had this a second day of fairly extreme spinal pain shooting up in, into my head. Um, it's sort of short term. Uh, I, I would say uh, the extreme pain is within an hour and then bad pain for a few hours following. Um, but for the most part, up until that, uh, it's totally tolerable. It's just short term pain for long term gain. And we got to look at the end result. You know, if we're doing things like this to save a life, I'm doing this to save my brother's life. This is personal for me. This isn't just a random person, you know. So it doesn't matter, I'll do anything it takes. Don't really care. Well, on that note, I'll do another video, hopefully uh, in the hospital of uh, filtering my blood out and uh, I'll see you then, thanks.